Daytime baseball here on ML. Digging in, Ben Zobrist. And we are ready for some daytime baseball. The one two. Lifted the other way out to left center. Kane on the move. Looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Into the box, Mookie Betts. He'll get to take his first cuts here. And a good comeback there. It's three and one. Lots of sunshine in the forecast. 83 degrees here at first pitch. The bouncer to the left side. Oh, what a stop on the slide. He's up with it. The throw. Oh, but he beats it out. Nearly a highlight real play, but they'll have a runner on here with one away. Two and one to Ted Williams now. The 2 1. Betts is on the move. And he goes and chops this one out towards second. Only play will be to first, so with the runner in motion, they stay out of the double play. Ready now, Sean Green, runner in scoring position with Sugan. 1 1. Sean Green. Pulled toward right center field. Kane is under it. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Digging in, Bryce Harper. It lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Now the 2 1. Waves and misses for strike number two. Two two pitches fouled away. And he chased it in the dirt. And the throw is there to record the first out. Stepping in, Mookie Betts. One out, nobody on. Fastball called strike. One and two. Strike three on a pitch in the dirt. Salto Lamarckia puts the tag on him, and there's two out. Now with the play, Ken Griffey Jr. First cuts for him here with the bases open and two away. Trying to strike out the side. Here it is. Hit down the line at first. Bellinger brings it in. And he'll step on the bag himself. And the inning is... Nick Castellanos now. As it'll be 5, 6, and 7 due up to kick off the second inning. A slider that time that runs away. It's three and one now. I understand pitching carefully to this guy in the box, but the man on deck doesn't represent any relief either. He's going to have to go after one of these guys. Popped him up. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for route number one. So coming to the plate, Charlie Blackman, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Swing and he pops him up. Gordon over to his right. And that's in there. Base hit. So that'll bring in the National League rookie home run record holder Cody Bellinger. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. In there. Base hit. Runner takes the turn at second on his way to third. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one out double. Standing in now with runners in scoring position, Jared Saltalamacchia. And he can give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. Blackman on third, Bellinger at second with one away. And did he go around? No, he did not. Ball two. 
Wow, how about that? He was tempted to make a swing at that pitch right there. That was way out of the zone, but he just kept his hands back enough. Catch is made in medium deep left center. Here comes the runner for the plate. The tag, and he is out at the plate. So much for our first run of the ball game. In now is Lorenzo Kane. He's set to lead off the home half of the second. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. Well, it's two and one now, and we haven't seen a fastball from him in this at bat yet. As a hitter, you've probably got to sit on that right now. And a fastball is hit on the ground towards short. Played on the backhand. And they will not get him at first as he's able to leg out the throw. Stepping in, Cody Bellinger. That nibbled the corner there, but missed two and one. Pulled toward right center field. On the run is Green. One away. Stepping up to the plate, Alex Gordon. Alex Gordon. Now a move over to first. And he is back safely at first, and that was almost trouble. And Gordon looks at ball four. And next up will be Franklin Barreto. Swung on and missed, and it's even at two and two. As a hitter, you know the pitcher's trying to work you down around the knees in a double play situation. So making him get a pitch up and actually in the zone is a must. So it's a backwards K on the changeup that time. Franklin Barreto goes down for the second out in the bottom half. And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Digging in, Sandy Alcantara. Juan Soto will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number 22. Breaking ball in for a strike. Obviously not where he wanted that curveball to end up, but I guess it fooled him enough to get the swing and miss. Pulled toward right center field. Harper coming on. One down. Here's Ben Zobris now. Flied out in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. Swing and a ball line hard towards short, but right at the shortstop for the second out. Now batting, second base. Mookie back. Digging in for his second at bat, Mookie Betts. Third inning, no score to this point. Oh, and a half swing there on a pitch out of the zone, indeed. It's strike two. I know you're standing on the mound, you got two quick outs right here. But you have to respect the fact that this lineup can hit you and hit you in a hurry. Number two hole batter up at the plate. He has a chance to get on and get the big boys up. Another payoff pitch. And, oh, that gets him on the mound. 
throw to first, but he's safe. And now the stadium's attention turns back to the man on the mound. Ready for another chance? Ted Williams. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. And he'll get back in safely. Robbie Scott takes over here with a runner at first and two gone in the inning. 1-1. One, one. Runner goes for second. Lifted into the air out towards center field. Kane is under it. And the inning is over. Donnie Hart, a 5'11 inch left-handed reliever, enters to take over on the mound now. Now to the plate, the pitcher, Robbie Scott. Jose Bautista will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Jose Bautista. And he'll just get a piece here as this is chopped foul at home plate. Still a ball and two strikes. He'll try again, one, two. Oh, and this ball is right deep down the line in left. And that is off the wall, but in foul territory. Foul ball. The one-two. Another foul ball, and this battle will continue. And a swing and a miss, and the dangerous Bautista is set down on strikes for the first down. So one gone in the inning now, and that will bring in the right fielder, Bryce Harper. Line to the right side, but that's a foul ball. A ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. Good swing on a tough pitch, and he'll stick around to see another one. Bottom of inning number three, nothing, nothing our score. Strikes him out as well. So make it back-to-back -back punch outs here to the first two men he faces out of the bullpen. In now, Mookie Betts. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. 3-2 pitch. He's swung on and missed strike three. Jose Ramirez. A six foot one inch right hander will be the one to get the call from the bullpen here. At the plate, Sean Green. So far, 0 for 1 with a fly out. The 1 2. Swing and a ball hit on the ground. Throw to first in time, one gone here in the fourth. Nick Castellanos now over one after a pop out in foul territory his first time through. The one one is swung on and missed for strike number two. Count still at one and two. Pitching has the upper hand early as we're scoreless in inning number four. Chopped weakly to the left. And there's out number two. Now Digging in now, Charlie Blackman. A base hit in his first trip. Rip to second base. Betts on the grass. He'll whip this one to first in time. And that ends the inning. Now at the plate, Ken Griffey Jr. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far.
Here's another one two. And this is swung on and missed by Griffey as Junior is gone for the first out of the inning. In now is Lorenzo Cain. Lorenzo And the pitch. So two and two now. Wow, he's cruising right now out there. Four straight punch outs and working on number five. Just hung in there on that one. Bases are empty, one man out. Boy, and they cannot touch him right now. Five straight strikeouts on the ledger, and there are two away. Stepping up now, Cody Bellinger. Flied out in his first at bat, so making 0 for 1 so far. The 1 2. He is swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. So that'll bring in the National League rookie home run record holder Cody Bellinger. He'll start off the fifth in this one. A one one. He is swung on and missed, and that's strike two. Hard hit ball to second. Betts is up with it. And the fifth inning will start with a ground out, one away. So striding in, Jared Saltalamacchia. The 2-1 home. Is hit very well to right. This one's hammered, and it's going to go. That one is gone! Into the box now, Donnie Hart. First at bat of the game for him here in the fifth, as he was a late entrant. into this one. Starling Marte will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Rowena Salias, a six foot one inch softball, will be the one that gets the call from the bullpen here. Chris Young will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. One out, nobody on. Chris Young. Now this one is blasted to left field, and there's no doubt about it. Back to back jacks. So it's back to the top of the order now. And set to go now is the shortstop, Ben Zobrist. Hit back up the middle. Barreto fields cleanly. And that's the second out. So striding forward now, Mookie Betts. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. into center field line drive base hit so the two out base hit and the top of the inning is still alive striding in Ted Williams he comes in 0 for 2 thus far Betts is on the move pitch outside the throw not in time as he steals second two out here and a runner at second and the runners breaking for third still one and two as he fouls it away Runner goes for third. In front of the change up there is this chop foul at home plate. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one two. Popped up. Gordon on the move. He tracks it down and that will end the inning. Hector Santiago, the lefty standing six foot even, takes over the pitching duties here.
Riding in. They haven't played perfectly as it's hit on the ground. Taken in by Zobris. Throw to first is in time for the first down. Stepping into the box, Franklin Barreto. He got called out on strikes his last time through. The one two. Swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Now batting, number 19. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Two out, nobody on. Giancarlo Stanton will get the call to pinch hit here as we'll see what he can do with two out and the base is empty. Two and one. Giancarlo swings and this ball is hit well into left field. And that nearly would have gotten him on the board. Instead, it's a long foul ball. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Blackman is under it. He makes the play and that'll end the inning. Now it'll be the four hole hitter, Sean Green.
Daytime baseball. Into the box is the veteran left-handed hitting Kenny Lofton as we're just about set for baseball. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And now he'll try to bunt his way on to start the game. Uh, this is foul for the first strike. Hit on the ground to short. Larkin comes up with it. And Larkin's throw is right there for the first down. At the plate, Robin Young. He'll get to take his first cuts here. First offering on its way. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Forecast high calls for 80 degrees, but we're at 76 here at opening pitch. Off the plate and in. It's a ball and a strike. Bases are empty, one man out. Ripped on the ground to first. And he'll take it onto the bag himself. Two gone now here in the first. Standing in, George Brett. The left fielder, number five, George Brett. First delivery to him on the way. Squared that one up just a little late. You could tell he was guessing right there, and he certainly wasn't guessing change up. That pitch was in his wheelhouse, and he was late. A little bouncer. That goes foul. Two strikes on him now. The wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Another one sent foul. Here's another 0-2. Swings on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. A swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes, and that will retire the side. Digging in, Barry Larkin. It lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Pitch on the way. Gary Larkin. There's a knee-high pitch that catches the zone. Down the third baseline. But uh, this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. The wind up and the 0-2 pitch. And a whiff at a good slider that time. And he's safe at first, so he's aboard on the drop third strike. Standing in, Scooter Jeanette. Here comes the first pitch. Takes a look at a strike over the inside corner. Well, clearly this guy doesn't need many warm-up pitches because he's 98 miles an hour in the first inning. News flash to the offense. They better get it going. Keeping it down here as it's to one and two. In a double play situation, that's the location you want a guy to swing at. More than likely, he's going to beat it into the ground. But he's safe at first as he gets back in time. Runners on the move for second. Got him swinging the throw. Ball's there, and he is out. Good throw. So bases are empty here with two gone. And here is the killer, Harmon Killebrew. And that's waved at and missed for strike one. Hey, this guy is dialed in right now. Two strikeouts and still working ahead. This is going to be a tough test for the offense. Got him to go after that one, and he's in a quick hold, 0-2. And, and a slider swung on and missed, and the side is retired. In is Christian Yelich. He'll look to get something going here in this scoreless ball game. Center fielder. Christian Here's a changeup to start the second, but that misses. It's a ball and no strikes. Hard hit ball to short. Picked up by Larkin. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. So 
one away here with the bases empty. And in steps a man whose number 42 has been forever retired, Jackie Robinson. Hard liner, but picked up on a hop. And quickly, there are two away. Here's Steve Pierce now. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Hit high and deep to right center. Pollard is there, and it's a very quick inning as the side is retired. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Babe Ruth. He's set to lead off the home half of the second. And this one's not close. It's in the dirt for ball one. Up top, it's 2-0. In the dirt, it's 3-0 and now. Well, that sets up a big pitch right here, Matt, because you don't want to lose the leadoff guy in a scoreless game. It's tough to work around the leadoff walk. 3-1 and one the count now. Into his motion, here comes the 3-1. and one. Popped him up. Lucroy waits on it. One out. Into the box now, A.J. Pollard, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Slider right over the middle, taken for a strike. Oh, that's for sure going to be a pitch he wants back. You're not going to get many balls right in the wheelhouse from a top-level arm like this. Heading out towards shallow right, Pierce. Ranging into the outfield, and he makes the catch for the second out. So digging in now, Cody Bellinger trying to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Feller sets his sights. First pitch on the way. A breaking ball taken at the knees for strike one. Still looking for our first hit in the ball game. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. Hit out towards second. Pierce has it. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. At the plate, Alex Bregman, as we are all set to begin the third inning in this one. High and deep to right center. Center fielder giving chase. One down. Now at the plate, Jonathan Lucroy. Jonathan Lucroy. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Very weakly on the ground. Foul ball, however, strike one. Both teams so far yet to crack the hit column. Slider taken here. One ball, one strike. The one, two. Chopped weakly to the left. Throw on to first, two gone. Next to hit will be the pitcher, Bob Feller. Bob Feller. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Hit back toward the mound. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Digging in the switch hitter, Jorge Posada. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Jorge Posada. A high fastball is in there. Oh, he looked like a caveman swing and a club on that one. It's 0 and 2 now. That's a real tough pitch to hit. That's as, in the pitcher's jargon, we call that the Hall of Fame pitch, that slider down and in. 
really the only way you're going to be able to hit that pitch is if you're looking for it down and in. And still then, it's a really difficult pitch to hit. Got him to go down swinging there. Jorge Posada is retired for the first out here in the bottom half of the third. We're seeing him in an absolute groove out there in the mound right now. Retired seven straight, and mechanically, he looks really consistent and fluid to me. Hit out towards second. Pierce is there. Left from short right gets him, and there are two away. So here now is the pitcher, Kyle Freeland. Kyle Freeland. And a good pitch on the inside corner for strike one. Bottom of inning number three, nothing, nothing, our score. Fastball called for strike two. Hey, this boy ain't messing around right now. Attacking his zone, showing a lot of confidence in his stuff. He's got two quick outs, and now he's got a swing and a miss. That retires the side. And Digging in to try it again. Kenny Lofton will try to get it going here to begin the fourth. This game is rolling right along as we move into the middle innings with no score. You'd think by now one of these two teams would be able to get some base runners on and get them in, but that hasn't been the case. And he'll step on first for the out three unassisted. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Robin Yount. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Grounded back up the middle. On to first, and that is two quick outs to start the fourth. Now at the plate, George Brett. His guy's still looking at a zero in the hit column. Popped up. Killebrew moving to his left. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. Striding into the box, Barry Larkin. He'll look to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Barry Larkin. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Brett is right there, and it's a very quick out number one. Now, now in the box, Scooter Jeanette, Scooter. who was a strikeout Jeanette. victim in his first try. A big roundhouse curveball in there for strike one. Still all zeros in the run column here in the fourth inning. Dan, does this continue, or does somebody score here? Oh, you have to love it. You know, Matt, we have so many of these games that are 12 to 10 and 9 to 8. It's nice to see a low-scoring pitcher's duel for once. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. So stepping in, Carmen Killebrew looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. Line drive, and that's a base hit in the center field. So we'll go a little deeper into the bottom of the fourth as that extends the inning. Settling in now, Babe Ruth. His last at bat didn't go his way as he popped out in foul territory. Strike one to start the at bat. The 0 1 pitch. And this one gets away. And he'll make it into scoring position here with two away as that'll be scored a wild pitch. And he struck him out, his seventh of the ball game, and that ends the inning. Coming to the plate now, Christian Yelich. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. We're moving through the middle of this ball game right now. They want to get things going. How about trying to get some base runners on or at least get a base hit? They don't have any hits going into this part of the game. Ruth is there. One pitch, one out. Coming to the plate now, Jackie Robinson comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Popped him up. And this will not be caught. It's a foul ball. Oh and one count and the pitch. Sent on the ground out to second. Jeanette is there on to first, and there were two down. Here's Steve Pierce now. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. And right into the shift. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0 and 1. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Swing and a little tapper. But that one rolls foul. The windup and the 0 2 pitch. 
Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. And with a big pitch here, he'll step off and rethink things. Bases are empty here with two men out. And a cut fastball, but this bounces near the plate for a ball. 0-2 in the dirt. Listen, this team's a very free-swinging team, so he's just going to go ahead and try to keep bouncing. If they're going to swing at him, he's going to keep throwing him. The bounce it with the left side, and that's through for a hit. Two-out hit. That'll bring Alex Bregman to the plate as well. And that'll bring up the former first-rounder, Alex Bregman. So far, 0-for-1 with a flyout. Ready with the 0-1. Hit hard on the ground to the right. A dive, but he can't get a glove on it. It's through for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. In is the catcher, Jonathan Lucroy, looking to make it three straight two-out hits here. He's got a runner in scoring position at second. Jeanette is calling for it. He hauls it in, and the potential go-ahead run will not come around. Now to the plate, A.J. Pollard. He'll start things out here in a tie ball game. Right fielder, A.J. And a high strike to begin the at-bat. It's 0-1. Rock-solid performance up to this part of the ball game right now. One of the keys, 90% of his first pitches have been for strikes. And when you do that, you really make the hitter swing at the pitch you want them to swing at. Little dribbler down the line, but it gets foul. Another 0-2 coming. Missed with a slider. Lifted in the air to shallow center field. Here comes Yelich. He gets there to make the play for the first out of the inning. So that'll bring in the National League rookie home run record holder, Cody Bellinger. Here's the first pitch to him. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. He's obviously been very impressive on the mound in this one. And I think the big reason why is his ability to stay out of the middle of the zone. That's kind of obvious, but it's clear to me that even when he misses his spots, he's not missing over the plate. And he pumps the fastball by him here. One and two now. That straight smoke at 99, guys. It's almost unfair. And he struck him out. And that's eight strikeouts thus far. Digging in, Jorge Posada he was a strikeout victim in his first try. First pitch of the at bat on its way. High in the air out to center field. Yelich is under it. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Into the box, Bob. Feller. Pitcher, Bob Feller. First delivery to him on the way. Right over the middle, knee high. Hit to short. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Ready once again, Kenny Lofton, 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Ready to deliver, here's the first pitch. Change up in for a strike. Boys, we see the pitch count. It's hard to remember the last time we saw a guy pitch this efficiently. Yeah, Matt, it's incredible to watch him go after guys. He's forcing a lot of early contact, and they haven't done a whole lot with the balls they put in play against him. And the sixth inning is progressing quickly here. Now two away. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. No balls in one strike. 
He's certainly done an amazing job right here, grinding to get early two outs with the number two hitter and the middle of the order lurking. He would love to see three, four, five with no one on base next inning. A wind up and the 0-2 pitch. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Back goes Pollock, but he has no chance to make the play. It's off the wall. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Digging in once again, George Brett. And as you might expect with a diamond player, he's got a few tools in the box, but he's best known for his contact hitting. Good lead off a second there. Now the pitch. Uh, couldn't quite hold back that time as the changeup fooled him for strike one. And there's ball one. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. And he lays off this one down and in for ball two. A lot of times you see guys in the middle of the order get worked away, but not right here. They're keeping it inside on him. Is that an effort to keep him from getting extended, do you think? Yeah, I think that's the idea, Matt. But he might spin the win if he starts looking for it in there. Working on hanging another zero, the pitch. is a swing and a high pop-up. And Posada will take this one in, and the inning is over. Ready now, number 19. He'll get things started here in the second half of the sixth. Tenor Fielder, number 19. And he'll hold off on the slider here to start the at bat. It's ball one. That misses 2 0. Oh. Now the 2 0. Oh. And it's fouled away. Never tempted to swing at that ball down low. It's ball three. Great A-B so far. I'd really like to see this guy work a walk and get on base for this team. Maybe give them a shot of confidence that they got a shot to get back in. And that one misses. So the leadoff man will head down to first on ball four to start the bottom of the sixth. Comes set and the 0-1. Now a bunt attempt here. One there on to Pierce at first, but too late to get them both. So the lineup flips over and digging in Barry Larkin. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. And he lays off a pitch in there for the first strike. Swinging, chased it well out of the zone, and there are two gone. Ready for another shot now. Scooter Jeanette, he's hitless in his two at bats so far. No balls and a strike to count. Hey, he looked like he was a little bit out in front on that breaking ball right there. The body can go. Threw it right past him, a swing and a miss at the gas, and that is. is Christian Yelich. No hits to this point. First pitch of the at-bat. Not sure if this is a powerhouse pitching performance by both teams or bad hitting, but as we're moving late into this one, it's about time somebody put something together to try to score a run. So a runner at first now with nobody out. And in steps a man whose number 42 has been forever retired, Jackie Robinson. First pitch coming, here it is. And the first pitch is chopped foul at the plate at strike one. Go ahead, runs the board here at first with nobody out. The 
for the delivery. A check on that go-ahead run at first. And the runner will get back standing. for the punch out and the offering. He'll try it again from first. Skied into very shallow right. Pollard is over a few steps as he puts it away for the first out. Digging in and looking for more. Steve Pierce. He steps in off a base hit in his last at bat. Before the delivery, a check on that go ahead run at first. And he's back standing. First pitch of the at-bat. He's running. Nope. Pitch misses low. The throw down. And not in time as he just gets in ahead of the throw. Good lead there at second. Here's the pitch. Hit high and deep out to left center field. Ruth looking up. Gone! A two-run shot that gives them the lead. And that'll bring up the former first-rounder Alex Bregman. Fly out and a single for him so far. Hard hit ball to second. And there are two away now. In is the catcher, Jonathan Lucroy. Third at bat in this one. He's bounced out and popped out in his two previous trips. Two out, nobody on. behind 0-2 now. Little guessing game going on right now. Being late on that fastball after the change, he had to be sitting off speed right there. Back up the middle. And there's his first base hit in this one. So a nice job there to fight off an 0-2 pitch and keep the inning alive for at least one more batter. Stepping into the box, Bob Feller. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ball game. The fastball here is he'll take a look at ball one, one and oh. And there he goes towards second. Chopped in front of home plate. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Now at the plate, Carmen Killebrew. He's one for two in this one. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Owen won the count. Wind up and the 0 1. Great tilt on the slider on the inside corner. Tying run stands on deck, but it'll only matter if the guy in the box can get on base. Yeah, and that has to be his mentality at the plate right now, Matt. He can't be the hero, so he needs to do what he can to give the guy behind him a chance to be the guy. So he racks up the swinging strikeout on the breaking ball. Carmen Killebrew is retired for the first out in the bottom half of the seventh inning. The hitter in this situation has to understand that this pitcher is on the attack, looking for a quick inning. If there's something in the heart of the plate, you better pull the trigger on it. Trying to send him packing for the second time. Uh, he's just rolling right now, and even dozen strikeouts for him in the ball game. So coming to the plate, A.J. Pollock. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. Strike one to start the at bat. Hard hit toward the hole. Great effort on the dive, but it's through into left. Stepping in, Cody Bellinger. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. And that misses ball one. Pitch out, nothing doing. Now a throw over, but he's safe at first as he gets back in time. Feller pauses, here's the 2-0. Swung on and missed, outclassed by that fastball for a strike. 
Hey, if these guys are going to have any chance in this one, they are going to have to set their sights a little lower. You cannot expect to get the barrel of the bat to that baseball. That is... And we'll have to leave it there as this... Phil Hughes has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Leading off the inning, Kenny Lofton, as they'll look for some added insurance before the bottom half of the inning. And a look at a first pitch curveball that's in the dirt. It's ball one. A one one. Now a flare out toward right center. Jeanette ranging into shallow right, but he won't get to it. And this should put a man in scoring position to start the inning. He's around second now as they're still searching for it out there. And he's going to get there as he starts out the eighth with a leadoff triple. Trying to pick things up where he left off. Robin Young, he doubled his last time through. Line towards center field. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And they'll extend their lead even further as the run from third is in to score. Stepping in, George Brett. He could really use a knock here. 0 for 3 in the game so far. ball sent back up the middle and that gets through so he'll have his first base hit make him one for four in the game now and he's able to get back in there at first safely stepping up to the plate Christian Yelich he singled his last time up from the stretch here's the pitch swing and a miss at a ball down there goes the runner. Offered at and missed. Here's the throw. And this is in time as Posada guns down another runner at second. The wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Down the line and fair. That's a hit. Running hard. He's digging for second. And he'll make it to second base now with two gone. So a runner at second, two down now, and in steps a man whose number 42 has been forever retired, Jackie Robinson. Ted Williams will look to provide a little two-out thunder off the bench as he'll hit with a runner at second and two away. And it'll get through into center field, a base hit. And another runs across as this is now a 4-0 ball game. Ready for another chance? Steve oh, Pierce oh. trying to keep things going now with a runner at first following the RBI single. The last at bat, Matty V. We heard this guy's a good fastball hitter. He got a fastball and didn't miss it. We'll see if they pick him. Well, the play's been made, and that retires the side. Digging in, Jorge Posada. He flew out in his last at bat. Catcher, Jorge Posada. Starting to run out of time. They haven't been able to score any runs as we're moving late into this one. A perfect time for this leadoff guy to try to get on base and ignite a rally. Lofton in the air out toward right center. Lofton is there. One away. In now, number 19. It was a walk in his last trip. Late square, and this is popped up. Throw to first is going to beat him, though, as they're able to thwart the bun attempt. Now to the plate, the pitcher, Phil Hughes. And he's getting his first plate appearance here in the eighth after entering off the bench just a little bit ago. Here comes the first pitch. He takes a high fastball for a strike. George Brett has moved into the on-deck circle now as he'll hit for the pitcher Hughes. 
John Brett. Brett Zero. behind, no balls and two strikes. And now he'll reconsider as he looks for a strikeout pitch. Feller into his motion. Here's the nothing and two. Breaking ball swung on in the dirt. Lucroy has it. And maybe some miscommunication there as the throw zips right by him. So the batting order turns over now and set to go Barry Larkin. He struggled at the top of the lineup in this one. Hitless to this point. High fly ball after straightaway center. Yelich is under it, makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. Trevor Hoffman enters from the pen to start the ninth inning as he'll try to keep the score right where it is, heading to the bottom of the ninth. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And this is fouled at the plate. Here's the 0 1. Number now the 0 1 is swung on and lifted out to straightaway center field. Number 19 is there and he makes the catch for the out. Digging in now, Jonathan Lucroy. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Now a swing and another fly ball here as things are getting busy out there in Central. Number 19 is there and he'll bring this one in. Now at the plate, Bob Feller. And an opportunity here for a fourth plate appearance here this afternoon. And you have to say, he's really earned it. Picked up by Larkin. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Here's the second baseman, Scooter Jeanette. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. Second baseman, Scooter Jeanette. Now a slider, and he gets ahead of him here 0-1. Objective number one right here is finding a way to get on base. So I'm not surprised to see him taking on the first pitch there. Popped him up. Pierce has a play. He's got it one away. At the plate, Harmon Killebrew was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. Here's the pitch. And he just keeps rolling along as he starts another batter out with strike one. I know he's well aware of the fact he can't tie this with one swing of the bat, but maybe he's trying to ignite the boys by driving something out of the ballpark. Into the windup, here comes the 0-2 pitch. And he struck out again. That's the third time he's gone down on strikes in this one. Stepping up now, Babe Ruth. He comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. The swing and a miss at the good old Uncle Charlie. Oh, and there's a drive to deep left center. You can pretty much forget about this one. This is way out of here. So striding in, A.J. Pollock. He's working on a one for three thus far. Good bite to the slider, and he takes strike one. Line towards center field, and that's in for his second hit of the afternoon. So the bottom of the inning is still alive after the two-out base hit. So that'll bring in the National League rookie home run record holder Cody Bellinger. 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him. Feller pauses. First pitch on the way. Change up in for a strike. Pollock leads off first with a pair of outs in the inning. And this is swung on and missed. So with that they find themselves down to their final strike here this afternoon. Here's a look over to first. But he's safe at first as he gets back in time. Has them down to their final strike. Here it comes. Runner goes for second. In the dirt here. And no throw, in fact, as he'll just hang on to it. Looking for the complete game. Here's the pitch. To two balls and two strikes now. Got him swinging in the dirt. Throw on to first, and the ball game is over. Well, we watched a really solid starting pitching performance, kept the opposition at bay, and as a result, he's our top's player of the game. 
his stuff was electric here in this one. So there's no doubt in my mind he's deserving. Look at all the strikeouts on his line. Trust me, that's not easy to do. So he was pretty special today. For the victorious visiting team, four runs on ten hits. One error, they left five men on base. For the home team, one run, four hits, no error, they left five men on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 53 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this afternoon. And we remind you, please drive home safely.
Diamond Dynasty is the most thrilling That's in. Nope, inside. 